let's jump in. TikTok. TikTok continues to be in the news. It continues to be threats to ban TikTok uh, in the entire country. I think it's the state of Montana uh, that is uh, has now banned TikTok from the state. I'm not sure how that works. Uh, I, I'm not sure if the network's in the state and allowed to carry it. If you have it on your phone, is the, are the police going to, like, ask to search your phone and check to see if you're watching TikTok? I mean, I don't know how you ban TikTok, how that works exactly. Uh, VPNs, a good way to get around um, any kind of ban within. I mean, the great uh, internet wall of China hasn't actually managed to um, restrict the ability of the Chinese to access Google and Facebook and, and uh, YouTube. Uh, but we're expected to believe that the great wall of uh, Montana, Montana now is competing with China on censoring what its citizens can watch. I mean, it's truly astounding. And it's, it's going to be interesting to see if this goes to the courts and what happens if it does go to court. In the meantime, Josh Hawley and uh, others are uh, uh, loudly advocating for banning TikTok at the federal level, uh, secreting the United States' great internet wall where the U.S. government starts telling us what internet services we can and cannot listen to, all in the name of, by the way, national security, because I know that you guys... Your behavior on TikTok has national security implications. What you do on TikTok uh, can really damage and threaten uh, the, the the security of the United States of America. I, I, I really don't get it. I don't get how they can get away with it. Good for Rand Paul, who I think is the only senator, senator who's vocally opposed to all this nonsense. Um, uh, this is uh, uh, unquestionably government censorship. There is no national security issue here. Uh, the, the issue has nothing to do with national security. This is all about, um, I think for people like Josh Hawley, it's all about the, quote, social impact of TikTok, the negative social impact of TikTok. They'd love to be able to regulate and control uh, Instagram and, uh, and, other, and other social media as well. Um, it, it, this is also a, a slam against China, anything to go, go, you know, go after China and, and guard them into reaction. Uh, TikTok, so they know what videos you watch. They know the cat videos you watch. How is this a national security threat if China has this kind of information? Now, to top all this off, the real efforts right now that TikTok is making, working with uh, Oracle, its U.S. partner, Oracle, the big tech company uh, run by Larry Ellison, uh, the, uh, they are they're calling this the uh, Project Texas. Um, uh, Oracle has its server farm in Texas where TikTok uh, is hosts um, all of U.S. TikTok. Uh, what uh, what they're working on is for Oracle to have the ability to be able to access, to have full access to source code, algorithm, and content moderation material um, uh, on the servers, and to be able to monitor and control the gateways where the data comes in and out. Um, and make sure that the data does not go to China. So it'll be interesting to see, this, this is all in the works, Oracle is working with TikTok uh, to make this happen. It would be really interesting to see if, um, if you know, once, uh, once Oracle gets access to all of this and actually secures this network and has the ability to prevent the Chinese government from accessing this information, uh, or for the information to leave the United States, whether uh, Senator Hawley and J.D. Vance and, and, and I'm sure some on the left will stop this nonsense of uh, trying to ban TikTok uh, from, uh, from the U.S. I mean, it would be interesting if Republicans spearheaded the banning of TikTok. I think TikTok has, what, 100 and, I don't know, 50 million uh, customers in the U.S. I, I read a headline somewhere where this would guarantee that the Republican Party would lose every election from here until eternity. People don't like it when you take their toys away. Don't take people's toys away. Certainly don't take people's cat videos away. So all of you who are afraid of TikTok and really worried about the Chinese government spying on your video TikTok habits, Oracle, a good old American company, um, run by Larry Ellison, who is a committed Republican maybe even free market guy. Um, Oracle is going to protect you. Oracle is going to have your back. And uh, God, 
people are so paranoid and ridiculous. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to iranbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Iran Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content. And of course, subscribe. Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are already subscribers and those of you who are already supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.